The Coalition made a swift return to surplus, the centrepiece of your election campaign. You made the failure to deliver that Labor's primary failing, yet now the talk of a swift return to surplus is abandoned. Doesn't that drastic shift in rhetoric fatally damage your credibility? You've got to be realistic about the challenges that you face. And what is in this document is a reduction in the deficit uh, from some 2.3% of GDP down to 0.7% of GDP over the budget and the forward estimates. But you're not addressing what, what I'm asking is, about the change in Well, you're asking me about politics, Lee. You're asking me about politics. What I'm talking about is what is actually happening with the budget. Politics what is frames with everything. It. Well, it may frame things for, for journalists. What it doesn't frame for me is how we go about setting the, the task of returning the budget to balance. I'm now, directly that's our asking job you and about rhetoric doing. and the framing that's changed over a, a short two-year period. Well, reality is reality, Lee, and we're confronting reality and we're dealing the re with the reality of what's happening globally and what's happening domestically. And what is in this statement today is a very sober, very honest and very patient statement which says we will return the budget to balance, not as an end in itself, by the way, but a means to an end. And the end is jobs and growth. And everything we're doing, whether it's in fiscal policy or innovation policy or infrastructure rollouts, it's all about jobs and growth. And we are not going to put at risk uh, our objectives on jobs and growth uh, by pursuing policies that would be contrary to that objective.